superstars at OJR alongside the Honky Tonk Man sitting in for Jim Cornette. And I want to send my best wishes to a fine human being, Mr. James E. Cornette. Well, I guess that's one way to describe it. Ladies and gentlemen, the Folks, uh, this morning, WWF Superstars is brought to you by the U.S. The Army. The Look for the, the Army hyperlink on the WWF the AOL site in the TV Zone section Here to find out where you can be. Oh, you can be. Well, Hawkeye, what do you think? What is your observation, your evaluation of this outstanding young rookie? When I see this young man, I see nothing but a lot of potential for him. Whether he's cut out to do the things that I have in mind, I'm not sure yet, but I really want to take a serious look at him. You know, he's got a great heritage, a great lineage. He's a thoroughbred. Oh, I'm sure he is, and it's coming from the background that he's come from, he, he just might have all the tools that he needs to do the things the Honky Tonk Man has in mind. Well, one thing's for sure, Honky, last night on Shotgun Saturday Night, we saw quite the altercation between uh, Rocky Maivia and Wild Man Mark Merrill. You heard me right, folks. We'll have some uh, footage of that a little bit later here this morning. And some folks say you were the cause of that whole thing, coming down and talking to Sable. Well, I didn't have a whole lot to do with it. All I wanted to do was get a closer look. You know, I had been contacted by a lot of people that Sable wanted to meet the Honky Tonk Man, much like a lot of other people around that want to see and meet the Honky Tonk Man. That's what happens when you're famous. Okay, great arm drag uh, takeover, and I know you're familiar with with uh, Rocky's father, Rocky Johnson. He was a great athlete, great tag team champion here in the WWF. Sometimes, Jim, I wish you just wouldn't say great all the time. Reserve that for the honky tonk man. He was very good. Why don't you put it that way? His, his father was extremely good, but I don't know if he was great. Well, I'll be I'll be more selective with my choice of adjectives. Thank you very much. I, I, I but you're great. That. I'll tell yes, you. Yes, I am. And, and this what, man is great, folks. That's what I'm doing. I'm looking for that great, that great, great athlete wow. that, that, that to, to be the greatest of all time. Another arm drag takeover by Rocky Maivia, who will be in the Royal Rumble. And wouldn't it be something? Now, this young man's stock would rise if he wins the Royal Rumble one week from today. Of course his stock would rise, and I would take a much closer look at him simply because of that. And at the Royal Rumble, of course, I'll get to see each and every one of the people that's involved. And the Honky Tonk Man will be able to make some sort of decision. I don't know what that's going to be yet. Well, there'll be 30 of the WWF's biggest superstars involved in the Royal Rumble matchup. And a good counter move there by Rocky Maivia to the hammerlock. I mean, when you look at a who's who, like, well, how about The Undertaker, who's going to be in the Royal Rumble matchup, Honky? What about Vader? Not only will The Undertaker and Vader go one-on-one, -on -one, but both those men will also be a part of the Royal Rumble matchup itself. And you know, like you said earlier, anything can happen. Anything can happen. I've been in a few of these Royal Rumbles, and this is probably the biggest one of all time. They've assembled the greatest talent in the World Wrestling Federation, and the Honky Tonk Man's geared up. I got the pink Cadillac running outside, and after Raw's over tomorrow night, the Honky Tonk Man's gonna be hitting double nickels with Vince McMahon in his polyester suit all the way to San Antonio. Well, I'll tell you something. You look at this list, you got Ahmed Johnson in the Royal Rumble matchup. You got Farouk in the Royal Rumble matchup. You got Bret Hart, you got Stone Cold Steve Austin. I mean, it reads like a who's who, folks. Nice sunset clip there by Rocky. Maya Villa in a near fall situation. Again, still to come that, uh, well, rather shocking footage. There's another lateral press in a near fall from last night's Shotgun Saturday night. And we saw a side that we will show you of wild man Mark Merrow that, well, absolutely shocked everybody. You know, I was involved in helping recruit the wild men to the WWF, and I, I thought I knew Mark Merrow. Maybe I was wrong. Well, you never know someone until it comes to money and women, and that's obviously what the problem is with Merrill right now is the woman part. With this great counter move by Rocky Maivia, standing six feet five, 275 pounds, Former outstanding defensive end for the uh, Miami Hurricane down in Miami, Florida. Kid is uh, just an amazing athlete who wants to make it on his own. One, two. I think the big test is going to be the Royal Rumble. If he can come out of that and do good, then he's well on his way to being a superstar. Rocky Maivia inside cradle on Dr. X and an ear fall. Rocky turned down Jim Cornette flat here on the Sunday Morning Superstars a few weeks ago. And of course, uh, we know that Sonny has made it uh, 
very well-known honky that she's extremely interested in Rocky Maivia. Well, there again, that's the case of a woman getting involved, and I understand Sonny's interested in a lot of the talent that the honky-tonk man's been looking at. And I can just say this, Sonny, uh, please don't interfere in what the honky-tonk man's got in mind because what I'm doing now is trying to find a shake rattler and a roller, and I'm not sure if Sonny can do that. Honky-tonk man on a mission from a rock and roll god somewhere to replace him, to clone himself. And Rocky being reversed. And nice move on, boy. What about a DDT on Sunday morning? That'll scramble your eggs. Rocky Maivia. The end is near. Rocky with the shoulder breaker. And a one, two, and three. Honky, this uh, the man that wins the Royal Rumble will wrestle for the WWF Championship at WrestleMania, and you know it don't get any bigger than that. No, it doesn't get any bigger than that, and that could be the person that the Honky Tonky Tonk Man could actually clone to, 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 to reach that greatness, to have that status in the World Wrestling Federation that only I have that I want to pass on to someone. What a warm uh, philanthropist is the Honky Tonk Man, and look at the great uh, high-impact offense. It was a DDT and then a shoulder breaker for the very impressive Rocky Maivia. And could the fairy tale come true one week from tonight at the 